Let's say that again. Hey folks, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, um, Krispy Kreme ANZ under pressure to address slur in new ad campaign. The iconic donut um, brand Krispy Kreme has come under fire for over its um, new campaign that appears to feature a highly offensive racial slur. The campaign made by Crave Agency um, Able in collaboration with Limehouse Production features four spots that aim to make Krispy Kreme donuts the star of celebrations like sport events, birthday parties, or major life milestones. In the short spots, the donuts replicate the letter O in words like footy, movie, and hooray. But one shows donuts um, popping up to replace the O in... Oh, hang on. All right. In um, the words like footy, movie, and hooray. But one of the donuts popping up to replace the O's in congrats, briefly spelling uh, congrats, then kunats. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so there was like um, two O's that you've seen before have um, appeared in the video. So, let's see. Oh, yes, that's the part. Yeah, unfortunately, it had to remove... Um, the the um the C out of the way because it will be too offensive for people of First Nations descent. Yeah, so spot um for con congrats sparked controversy after it momentarily spelt a highly offensive slur. Okay, so the video featuring the offensive slur is no longer available on YouTube, but other um free spots are still. Oh my gosh, I still are so. The campaign is also um, being rolled out across digital platforms, out of home advertising and in-store media. News.com.au has approached Krispy Kreme for comment on the blunder, but is yet to receive a response. Mumbrella um, approaches able to ask whenever the gap was noticed in production, but it is understood the client is being aware of the concerns for the apparent slurs. Australia's um, advertising watchdog ads uh, ad standards um, confirmed to news.com.au it has not received any complaints about the campaign yet. But a spokesperson um, said the body would initiate investigation if some were submitted. Anti-racism um, campaigner Stephen Hagen is hit up at the campaign calling it disgraceful um, that such a slur slipped through a promotional campaign for a popular brand. Um, as of the original, um, originator of changing the Kuhn um, cheese brand to cheer is an absolute disgrace that in 2023 someone think they can come with an ad like that on a product that is very popular with people of colour, Dr. Hagen told um, Mumbrella. Okay, so this is used to be the offensive um, name, but now they just replaced it with a different name, Cheer. Anyway, the cheese tastes the same anyway. So, um, Dr. Hagen um, was behind a long running campaign that led um, to the rebranding of one of Australia's most iconic um, cheese brands to Cheer um, in 2021 amid heightened awareness and concerns about racism. The former name was inspired by the cheese monger Edward William Kuhn, who developed a technique of ripening cheese known as cooning. However, Kraft um, Australia red um, Kuhn cheese has nothing to do with the ripening method or made by Edward Kuhn or his company. But the name carries the weight of being a um, highly offensive um, racial slur, uh, which was used in Australia at the time the cheese was introduced in uh, 1931. <laughs> Six years after the cheese was handed to the Canadian giant Sabuto, the chief executive officer, Linda A. Sabuto, made the polarizing decision to rename the cheese to cheer and promoting, prompting outraged customers about to boycott the brand and declare it was cancel culture and political correctness gone mad. Okay. 
Now, the word seemingly resurfaced in uh, Krispy Kreme's um, bizarre blunder, much to Dr. Hagen's disappointment. The word has put my family and my people through so much trauma, and it's just disgraceful to see this happening, he said. Krispy Kreme's um, campaign encourages Aussies to pick up a box of donuts to sweeten the moment of major celebrations. Able co founder and di creative director Simon Fowler said the agency had a blast working on a collaboration with the talented team at Limehouse and it's a crispy client. The donuts aren't necessarily the first thing people think to bring, so there, there's a real opportunity here to prompt awareness of just how much joy a, Chris, a box of Krispy Kreme donuts um, can bring to some of those much-loved social get-togethers, he said in a press release. Oh, my goodness. I just couldn't get over this um, blunder. I mean, like one, the, one of the words I spelled as cool. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, folks, what do you reckon? Do you reckon Krispy Kreme should at least um, come up with a replacement ad or they should at least pull that one out? Let your thoughts know in the comms section. Have a good day.